Hi guys, it's Rain, the math person. Before we get started, make sure you hit that subscribe button. If you don't want to be bombarded with all these new videos, make sure you turn off that notification. Other than that, let's just dive right into this question. In this question, I'll be going over question 113 on SO exam P. So pause the video real quick and try this problem yourself. Okay, I see you're tempted, let's just dive right in. So they ask you to find the axis of premiums over claims. So that's basically saying, okay, so after you pay out the claim, right, how much premiums do you have? over so that's going to be equal to plain premiums minus claim and honestly if you screw this up that's not going to matter as long as you keep it consistent you're just going to get a negative number but so then this is equal to oh given that husband survives at least 10 years so if husband survives right and assuming there is no um, polygamous relationships or anything like that we have Assume your husband survives, wife survives, right? That's another possibility. Or if a husband survives, wife could pa um, pass away within the 10 years. So those are the only two scenarios that could add up to the probability that husband survives. So then the probability that husband survives and wife survives right, is right here, 0.96. The probability that husband survives, only husband survives, is 0.01. 0.01. So the total probability of that a husband survives is equal to 0.97. So if we're looking at conditional probability, I might actually like draw like a little t charts. So what would the p minus c be? So premium for everyone is going to be a thousand because there's two of them and it it costs 500 each. So that's premium is a thousand minus claim. So there's actually no if both of them survives, they're not going to get anything in claim because no one died. But however, if wa the wife dies, you get $10,000 here, right? So then the actual P minus C value here is going to be 1,000, and right here is going to be negative 9,000. And what are those po conditional probability? The conditional probability of H and wife, husband and wife surviving, given the husband survives, is going to be equal to 0.96 divided by the probability that husband survives, which is, which is 0.97. And likewise, this right here is going to be equal to 0 0.01 divided by 0 0.97. So then solving this out, the expectation of x given h is equal to 1,000 times the probability of that x. It's going to be 96 over 97 minus 9,000. What is this probability? 1 over 97. And this is approximately equal to? 896.907, which is our answer E. If you guys have any questions, feel free to leave them down below. Otherwise, as always, make sure you like, subscribe, and share. Bye!